And we are live. Greetings, Internet. Kunde's here, and let's continue our Meissner Porcelain campaign. Where we last left off, we had sent Russia to attack our Middle Eastern enemies, because finally he could justify his existence in our alliance network. And things were looking actually pretty okay. What is this? Saxony? Okay, so it's just... Well, all of this is... Russia doesn't want any of Uzbek for some reason. I won't question it. Um, I don't necessarily want to overly aggressively expand in that general direction, because I don't want to anger the Ottomans. Uh, Haji Tarkan looted. Oh. Oh yeah, look at that, Haji Tarkan. I mean, that, that's unfortunate. But that's not, as, that's not the heartland of our empire or anything, it's just a nice place to be. So Transoxiana is at low enthusiasm and doesn't want to be in this war anymore. Merv has just fallen, which means we can move on to Herat. Very good. What is this? What is all of this? Oh yeah, right, you're going after rebels. Okay, it's coming back to me, it's coming back to me. This guy's going back after rebels. Um, meanwhile... The question become became, rather, what I wanted to do with Transoxiana. Because Transoxiana owes me a couple cores, I'm pretty sure. Uh, if I look for the Kazakh flag, that little bright powder blue flag. But not no guy's flag, there we go. He has, I believe, three Kazakh cores when I last checked. Yep, that sounds accurate. Uh, Lorraine can be happy, I guess. So I do want these three. But I would like... Um, where's my armies? You go take Kiva. I would like to take a snake from Kazakh to... Oh, hey, Nogay has retaken Nogay. Meh. But yes, I would like a snake from Kazakh to Khorasan. So that I can uh, also take some Khorasani stuff. Again, probably not too much of it. Because I don't want to anger our... Uh, our best frenemy Ottomans here, who is... Somewhat mad at us. Don't want to make it too bad. But I do want to connect the path from Kazakh to, Tran to Khorasan. So that I have access to it. Um, what kind of points do I need? I am currently behind in all of the points except for Diplo. Uh, I cannot ask for Diplo points. So, am I unlocking a... I'm unlocking a military idea. So let's ask for uh, military points. I need them more than whoever I just asked this from ever will. Still haven't passed Spain as a great power. I want to become the greatest of powers. Okay. Uh, we've dealt with... One of the rebels. Oh, hey, Bulgaria. Thank you, Bulgaria. What is all of this? Gordon County in Shun. Huh. Oh, the, the claim exists! Yes, Kazakh, you did the best thing you could have done. Okay, you're not retaking Merv. That is just not happening. Get the hell out of my Merv. And then we'll go sit on uh, Konjikala or something. And then we'll get a really nice piece with the uh, Transoxiana, where he'll be cut in pieces, and Kazakh's scores will be returned where they rightfully belong. Okay, he's getting obliterated. Oh, wow. That is that is not even close. That is a stack wipe of epic proportions. Golestan has fallen back to Khorasan. That's a bit unfortunate. Can I deal with uh, Uzbek? Do I... Do I even care about Uzbek? I mean, I want to say no. Maybe I'll run away with Zetryu for posterity. I don't really care about anything, really. And I don't want to anger too many people. So give me all your money. War reparations. Uh, transfer trade power, sure. And all treaties with... Uh... Ugh, none of the... How are you even in this war? Oh, no gay. Yeah, sure, whatever. You're irrelevant to spec. That'll just give nicer borders. It's not a matter of needing it. I'm doing that for the borders. Also, it would help if I wasn't paused right now. Kiva is ours. And by ours, I mean Kazakhs. How overextended are you? Oh wow, he's very uh, war-exhausted, but his overextension is not very high. 
I have an idea group. Uh, not a group. I have a single idea. I can get Corvettes, so I will do that. I now need two of the useless quality ideas because they're both. That reminds me. Speaking of boats, um, my fleet is ready, except for apparently one transport. I'll uh, cancel this final transport. And I will send you to deal with Norway's little trade company problems. Uh, we've converted Berg to the one through fate. I forgot I even did that. Include subjects. Let's convert uh, something in our vassals, maybe. Um, Trondolag, maybe? Let's help poor little Norway out. If I can get him to uh, be fully Protestant, I could probably just... Well, I say I could annex him. But at the same time, it is kind of useful that uh, I let him colonize things. Oh, look at that. He's down here now. Uh, I don't need legitimacy that badly. I do want to take up in Diplo. And there we go. Advanced Cassius Bailey. The answer to our Chinese question. Finally. One Diplotec away. Oh, I just killed Nogi, apparently. Permanent navies. Excellent. Also, she is having some... Uh... Oh, wow. Kazaki even made claims here. Oh. Oh, he's been making all the claims. He is such a good boy. Okay. Speaking of good boys, Kazak, I have more treats for you. Sue for peace. This does not anger the Ottomans, as it should be. All right, I won't take anything else, except maybe for, wow, it's a lot of money. Wow, I can actually run away with a large amount of money. There we go. Transoxiana is gone from this war. And now, war is trivial. I mean, it was trivial the moment we were able to throw Russia at it, but uh, now it's truly, truly trivial. And then we can look at China again. Hopefully without angering uh, anyone else. Timmy's... Fi oh. Okay, let's be careful here. We'll transfer this to Kazakh and I will probably feed it to... What, 24 development though? Can I even afford to feed it to Kazakh? Actually, I can. Interestingly, I can. And now I'd actually say that Kazakh is full-sized and should be annexed. So that I have access to uh, sh to Shun and essentially China in general. That might be what I'm gonna do. But at least, for the, at the very least, now we border Khorasan. Which means now if we want to expand into actual Persia, we can. Not that we need to, but we have that option. Ooh, innovativeness. What are we at in Innovatives now? 66.3. That is a huge discount. Okay. We're about to fall behind in military tech for a little bit. That'll uh, that'll fix itself. As soon as we're done with our ideas. The thing is, Naval Drill and Copper Bottoms, not so useful. I'm showing up here. Let's go help poor Norway from his... Uh... Why would you spawn these kinds of rebels? Why would you make trade companies when you can't even defend it? <sighs> it's not even the same kind of rebel. Oh, it's war exhaustion that's causing them to happen. Well, probably in religious unity. That's okay. That's okay, we'll protect Norway from all of his enemies. Inside and out. Bessa, Bessa, whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. He's over here now. My boats! No, he took my forts! Um, I don't think any of my boats over here are in danger right now. Maybe I'll go hide them in Bulgaria. Well, that seems to be where he's going. Kozvin. Korasan is uh, unseaging himself pretty hard. What is Russia doing in here? Wait, what? I saw someone at medium. Oh, Kazakh. Yeah, Kazakh is... Uh, Kazakh's tired. Russia's really excited about this war, though. But is he really doing anything with it? I have no idea. Diplomat has died. We're in August. It's not, uh, it's not a bad time for Diplomat to die. I can afford this guy, so I'm gonna hire him. All about reducing that aggressive expansion impact. 
over time, making it decay faster. Oh, it's only 34. I'd love to run away with some uh, Korasan stuff as well when I piece Snow Guy out, but it's gonna be tricky. Right now he's not accepting it. Probably because he thinks he has a chance. He thinks Korasan will protect him. Little does he know. Korasan is uh, only alive because he was further away from us than Transoxiana was. Uh, Rebgong, Sangi Separatists. Oh, hey. I get to uh, kill two rebels in one fell swoop. Look at that! Efficiency. I'll have to unseach both provinces, though. That's okay. Minor inconvenience. Oh, what? No gay separatists from Kazakh? Oh, okay, they're, they're, they're dead. They're dead in the sea of Russia and all of that. It's gonna be a solved problem. Um, yeah, the Khorasan War is trivial. It's not... Uh, he was always annoying, but now he's uh, kind of a joke. He will also stop being defender of the Sunni fate. Which will open up the door for us to have to attack a different defender of the Sunni fate, which will probably be the Ottomans. I'd love to attack the Ottomans. They're like the Great Britain, and that's gonna hold me back this whole time. As long as they're allied to Great Britain. Repkong now belongs to Kazakh. Let's go deal with this guy. Is she allied to anyone? He is not. If I attacked him, Shun would not even come right now. That would be such... That's... I mean... I'm gonna unsiege this and I'm gonna do it. Oh, he has more provinces here. But none of them have Chinaware. Although... He could be made into a vassal as well. There might be reconquests looming about. There are some. Ooh, there are some. Could attack him, make him a vassal. Go for the reconquest throat. But I'd love to start annexing Kazakh first. So really, we need to end this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Korasan is wrecking one of my stacks here. Mostly because I'm attacking in mountains. Despite having better discipline and better tactics. I was driven back. How much war score do I have against Korasan? Because he's really like... Just give me money. Okay, just give me some money. You're not even important. Alright. I'll come back for him later. Now I found Eat Noge. Now, Noge will accept his fate, because his fate is sealed. And now, Kazakh can be annexed. It's going to take a while, but that's okay. We're now done with the uh, wars of Middle Eastern aggression. So, Noge being dead is a good thing. How much aggressive expansion do you feel? 102. The Ottomans currently feel 40. Nice. We probably could have taken one or two provinces from Khorasan, but I'm okay not having done it. Um, Kazakh's annexation has begun. She can be attacked. It's not even going to be difficult. Wait a minute. Is that his capital? That's his capital. He's currently on. I'm going to steal this unseaging of his capital. Oh, that's funny. Hello, she. Goodbye, she. I'm gonna just secure this guy without breaking a sweat. Uh, you're black flag, but you're about to not be. Then I'll have to figure out where I hide you. Kiva makes sense. No, he does not. Um, oh, there is Taraz over there also that makes sense, but Kiva will, uh, Kiva will do for now. Oh, he's scoring. He's happy. He's a very happy vassal with everything I've given him. Now his time has come and gone. And she will be the new vassal to feed. Let's look again at the trade goods. It's uh, eyes on the prize. Taozhou is not a she-core. But Kazakh has a claim on it. So we will be able to take it. 
Shen has no mandate. He's like the Korea and Min. Shame about the Korean alliance. Hey Korea, you wanna not be allied to Shen? No, he doesn't want to not be allied to Shen. That's unfortunate. Who else are you allied to? Shen and Karadel, that's not even a hard war. Korea and Min. Min is uh, this derp down here. Does he have? Uh, he has a few cores and claims. He has two cores and two claims. Interesting. Chinaware. He has a core on a Chinaware province. I'll probably try to vassalize him. We'll, we'll, we'll play the vassal game with China a little. We'll. Uh... Hey, she. You want to become my vassal? It's a great place to be, I speak from experience. I have a lot of them with uh, satisfied uh, customer reviews for being my vassals. Gold Rush! Oh yeah, what the hell do I do with all this money now? <laughs> it's like, the game is like, here's a ton of money. Enjoy. Okay, I'm gonna build some manufactories, but not, oh wow, okay. Not bad for a workshop, cathedrals. I can build a few of them. If I looked at religion, I might want to build cathedrals also where I can't convert things. Like Astrakhan. I might want to build a cathedral here. Where else do we got? Azov. I'd love to convert that as well. Upgrade the temple. Um, Mainish? Well, essentially this entire place, right? No, this one. That's not a good place for a cathedral, though. Uh, Crimea itself. If it can get two more development. Or get rid of the sh I'll get rid of the shipyard. Who builds a shipyard? Okay. Good. Um... Converted Trondolag. This is good. Now we can convert, let's say, Goldingen. Sure. All right, we've invested a bunch of money in our nation. You want access? You have access. Um, we have started the annexation of Kazakh. We might want to annex an HRE vassal at the same time. The only one left that I have that I know of is uh, technically Gelray. I can totally afford to annex Gelray now. It's gonna be even a great source of revenue. Although, will I be able to state him? No, that's gonna be tricky. Oh crap, the Kong Separatists! I'm pretty sure I killed them, yeah, but I never unsieged the final province. Ah! Whew, good thing I checked. Because Norway was about to spit out a few things. Uh, ignore them, goodbye prestige. Five Shelly Heretics and Goldingen. But I started converting that. Um, okay, let's go sit on the final Xi province. He will accept his fate as the most glorious vassal to our nation. Great Horde Separatist in Saratov. There's also another thing that's, that uh, came out. Oh wow, she has a lot of provinces. Yeah, I think Shun is doing a Shun explosion. Um, I have an army for this. Okay. Shun, uh, Shun, she is a hundred war score, so it is time for peace. The best kind of peace, the kind where he becomes our vassal. Um, if I can get five prestige doing that. And give up claims on my vassal. Yeah, that sounds good. Aggressive expansion. This angers nobody of consequence, but I do have to be careful around the Chinese people. Okay, she is now our vassal. We have a foothold in China. This is a Xi core. Ming is allied with Chahar and Changsheng. Uh, Yue is allied with Wu only. Wu is... Three piddly provinces with a bunch of cores. Okay. I will, I think, 
Annex Gallery. He is fully Protestant. And he is a bit of a waste of a Diplo slot right now. More to matter that I have far too many of those Diplo slots. Oh crap, Diplo point generation is gone again. Uh, I can afford... It's not telling, but I can still afford to get this guy to level 3 at least. I am gonna not have Diplo points for a while. But the idea is that by not having them, I'll have them later. I'm gonna keep this guy around. For purposes of declaring a war, probably on Yue. Who refuses the call? That's even better. You owe me three cores. I intend to collect. Um. Oh yeah, right, and I have a claim on Taozhou. Eh, that's okay. Alright. We're gonna start expanding in China. In the way we know how the best. Vassal time. I need to get more Diplo points. I need to get more Diplo point generation. I'm still making 36 ducats. I can probably afford to level up this guy some more. Uh, sure, we'll think about their representation. I don't care. War exhaustion is a bit of a problem, but... This is not going to be a tricky war. This is going to be a straightforward war. I should have armies around that can attest to that. My boats are not safe right now. They're gonna go hide in Besarabie. Okay. Get the wars in China. We are finally where the uh, campaign's objective is. We are finally in China. We are poised to begin uh, acquiring the Chinaware. We don't have any yet. I don't believe. Look at trade goods. I don't have any yet. Oh, my king just died. That's uh, not a good thing. I kind of hope that Anna doesn't live long because she has really terrible stats, but her regency council will be really bad. Gordon County. Alliance breaking with Great Britain. What? Wait, 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 wait. Great Britain. Great Britain. Let's talk about this. Rationally, calmly, like good human beings. Also, trust me more. There we go. Solid alliance. Alright. Yeah, the British alliance is safe. Austria. There's a royal marriage. Here's some more trust. Okay, I feel safe. Preserve these alliances. They are my lifeline. I mean, disaster. Gordon County is building very rapidly. Um, I'm probably going to let it happen. I actually kind of really want it to happen. Right now, it's mostly because... Oh, I'm cruel. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I'll take it. The war with UA should not be too difficult, but... Um, okay, no one of value has cores on you and Ling. Okay, so we'll probably just try to feed a snake down here. What's my aggressive expansion in... Um, in China? Uh, 20 right now. I'll see how much I can run away with without triggering a coalition. Then we'll patch up our Cowardin County. We'll have to probably build uh, some more troops to like deal with it. Uh, lower Yik in Noge. Oh, that's in uh, that's in my stuff. I'm spawning rebels. That's not nice. It's okay, Cordon County is coming. It's gonna it's gonna come. I don't plan to end the war with UA that quickly. Although it's not gonna be a difficult war. Also, do you have Chinaware UA? You have two Chinaware provinces. So I kind of want both of them, but I don't think I can run away with both. Because one of them is through Canton. Hmm. Charge! 
One thing I could look into as well, maybe, is diplovassalizing things. Sure, we'll quarantine some provinces. Russia wants magic and have it. Wait, that means Russia's king has died. I lost uh, military advisor. It's going to be manpower because I need more manpower. Russia, how old is your... Uh, oh, he has a Rudikovich. Oh, they got so close to the finish line. <sighs> I would have liked to be Russia. That would have been good. Oh well. Let's uh, let's secure our China in the meantime. Thankfully, I don't think a PU with Russia will be necessary. He hasn't expanded too badly in the Far East. Um, Shikaka does not feel any aggressive expansion. Korea felt one. Um, let's have someone working on allies again. I do suspect I lost a bit of brownie points over there. Okay. Oh, there's a fort over here in Wundum as well. Ah. I'll need to eat in Lanzhang as well. There's a lot of uh, Chinaware over here that I need. Tonkus, Kotai. All of those people. Keep Shak Garze. Idea, idea, the second of the useless of boat ideas is taken care of. Okay, let's go defend poor, uh, poor she. He needs, uh, he needs our help. He's gonna get it, okay. Transfer all of this to she and then feed him. I mean, it is a reconquest of Shi, technically. The one that I'm looking for also is uh, Xiuhing, because it's the first Shinaware province we could get. I'm gonna go sit on it. In the event I can run away with it. And then we'll go deal with the rebels. I doubt I'll be able to. Or if I am able to, it's gonna take a bit more effort. Uh, Shi. How's my uh, absolutism actually? I got the Cordon County. I'm at 64 of 73. Not bad, not bad. It's gonna go down to about 53 when Cordon County triggers. Um, Cordon County triggers in yeah, in a bit. Okay, if I transfer you to she, uh, give to the state. I'll take the money, because I'm gonna need the money while I'm dealing with Cordon County. Okay. I want to piece out Yue. I want these three for sure. And I want this snake. This snake angers Yue and Ming, but it's it's actually acceptable. So if we can get the war score, we can afford to run away with the very first Chinaware province for our empire. That would be amazing. And then if I look for more Chinaware, Ming does not seem to have any. Uh, we'll have to see what we can do with that. But yeah, um, I think the, ch the, the China is coming our way. It's gonna happen. So, hello, Hava. Ooh, I have claims on your face. It just so happens I want to, uh, invade you. Um... Kasper van Moon for the Flemish Company. Uh, he wishes to become a general. For 50 ducats, I get a general. Hmm. I'll gain 5 prestige. Excellent. Um, how do you feel about that, UA? I don't feel very good about it. I guess that's understandable. Got the rebels over here that needs dealing with. And then we need to focus on. Oh, oh, Diplo points are non existent. But Galray has been, I think, the focus. Yeah, Galray is the one that uh, the game is focusing on annexing. Which works for me. Popularization of silk fabrics. This is good. Atrashkani separatists and Sarai. I have an army for that. Okay. As long as we always have an army for that, we're good. This will increase the demand of Chinaware. I wonder why. 
Forced lane from Mason, which is... Uh, the event has happened. And this... I get Forced lane and Mason. There we go. I gain a mill in Dresden. Chinaware is now produced in Dresden. Gains four base production. And I actually make Chinaware worthless. <laughs> ah, that's hilarious. I have ruined the cost of porcelain. How ruined are we talking about here? It's Well, three is not a bad thing. It actually just literally undoes European traders in China. That's hilarious, though, that I uh, I now own my first Chinaware province. <laughs> uh, excellent. Excellent. Huey, let's talk about peace. You want to pay me for this? Uh... I'm glad we could reach this agreement. The singer's a couple people, but none of them matter. She is now super massive. But he's not angry at us. Not anymore, at least. Uh, I think it also affected his... Uh, liberty desire. Oh, yeah. Gave him a lot of land. Okay. Um, I could invade Ming. I'd have to fight Chahar and Chang Chang. Um, no, my Diplo points. Although invading Ming is probably a good thing. Just because Ming also has uh, she cores. And I can see where I can go from there. Can I vassalize Meow, for example? Uh, distance between borders is a bit too high. Even though my vassal directly borders him. Okay, okay, I see how this is. See how this is. Once my uh, diplomat comes back, Ming's gonna get it. Ming owes me some cores. Chahar and Changsheng will accept the call. Can I... Chahar is this thing. Changsheng is that thing. I don't really... No, oh, Changsheng can be fed to Xi. Uh... Let's of Yui. Yeah, I can, I can do that. Changsheng I can feed to... Uh, to Xi. And Shahar I'll just ignore, because I don't even think he has anything of value. That's a lot of livestock, wow. If I look at Bowding... Yeah, I don't care about Shahar at all. Shahar's irrelevant. In fact, Ming is arguably irrelevant too. Wow, you're about to explode, Shun. Well, you're at war with Shahar right now. Shahar, you want to stop being allied to Ming? They are subject of Korea. Oh, okay. Alright, fine. So we'll just attack uh, Ming. For reconquest. Can't call anyone, that's okay. And apparently I've reached I've reached the end of the of where I'd want to end the stream. So for now, I'll actually thank you guys for watching. And I will see you next time where Ming is gonna give me back my cores. See you guys then.